Welcome back. In this video, we're going to take a look at styles, also known as layer styles. Layer styles can be applied to shapes. They can be applied to regular layers, you know, just, just whatever you want. Text layers, they go anywhere. So let's look at how to do that here inside of Photoshop. If you have any layer, uh, layers in your timeline panel currently open, go ahead and just, just uh, close them right now. Move your playhead to the very end of where we were last time. Actually, it should be, let's see, we should be at the, yep, that's good. Okay, yep, you don't want to see the end of that there. I'm going to close that. I am going to choose, let's see, how about a polygon? My polygon currently has 15 sides. How about let's make it seven for something fun and funky. All right. Hold down shift and just drag it onto your page. This does not have to be centered on your page, okay? Because this is really just for fun. All right. So twirl open your polygon. And I am going to click on style. Hey, you'll notice down here that I've got a couple of new things, vector mask position and vector mask enable. That's because this is a shape. You could, you could set keyframes on this if you wanted to, but we're working with style. All right, so styles, come back over here to the polygon layer in the layers panel, and I want you to double click on it. That will bring up the layer style dialog box where you can choose from many different options. I am going to get a gradient overlay because those are fun. This is just a, a generic gradient that they've got chosen. Whatever you choose is just fine with me. But I'm going to start with a gradient of zero. Uh, excuse me, an opacity of zero. Click OK. So it, you should see no changes on your screen at all. Then move your playhead forward a little bit. Click a, uh, insert a new keyframe. Double click on your layer again. And then this time for your gradient overlay, move the opacity on that gradient all the way up to 100. And you should see it change in the background. Then click OK. Now let's scrub the playhead and you should see it change from white to that gradient that you chose. All right, looking pretty good. Now think about the timing. Let's, let's watch this. So I'm going to back my playhead up a little bit there and hit the space bar to play the video. Let's see what it looks like. That's a long time to just sit there and look at that. <laughs> so I'm going to I'm going to make this a little shorter just because. All right. That's better. OK, guys, that was a layer style. And frankly, you can use any of those layer styles in that particular um, dialog box. You, you just set the keyframe. You put it put the setting at what you want to start with. Then you would set a second keyframe and you would move the settings to whatever you want them to be. I hope that was easy and I'll see you guys in the next video.